Welcome to our tech tutorial. Today, we're tackling a specific challenge that many our Markdown users encounter. Our viewer is trying to add a crucial meta tag for Internet Explorer compatibility in their HTML output. The question at hand is how to insert the XUA compatible meta tag as the very first element after the header in an R Markdown HTML document. This is essential for ensuring proper rendering in Internet Explorer, as highlighted in a helpful MSDN article. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, we're going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution you need. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy, just like me, and hopefully get to that resolution. Now, let's get on to the video. To add the XUA compatible meta tag in your R Markdown HTML output, we need to customize the header of the document. Let's start by opening your R Markdown file. Next, we will use the YAML header to include custom HTML. Add the following lines at the top of your R Markdown document. Now, create a new file named header.html in the same directory as your R Markdown file. This file will contain the meta tag. Finally, save both files and knit your R Markdown document. The XUA compatible tag will now be the first tag in the head section of your HTML output. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To add the XUA compatible tag in our Markdown HTML output, first locate the default HTML template file. You can find it in your R library directory. Then edit this file to include the XUA compatible meta tag at the beginning of the head section. After adding the tag, save the HTML template. Finally, specify this custom template in your R Markdown YAML header to ensure it is used in your document. And that's it guys. I hope this video has helped find that solution that you're looking for. And if it did, please hit the subscribe button. I'd really appreciate it. Now, until the next time that you need technical help, I hope you have a good one.